Angel6942 calling in. Um, Angel6942 calling in. Angel6942 calling in. The date in human years is Friday the 26th of March 2021. And the weather is much nicer now, uh, uh, and it's spring, and the sun's out, and daffodils are out. And I keep talking about the weather every week because apparently it's the humans in the UK's favourite pastime. Though I don't believe that, I, I think it's protesting and rioting, because ever since I've got here, that's what they do almost every day. I mean, they like to protest about anything. They protest about the closing of the road, they protest about the opening of the road, they protest about train lines being built. I mean, this week they protested about protesting or not being able to protest. And, and today, and on Wednesday, they protested about wanting to kill Bill. Whoever the poor man is, um, I think they made a film about it. <laughs> now, I got the human host to look into all these protests uh, and when it started, and apparently it's gone back in time in history because they had the uh, Peasants' Revolt back when they had King Arthur and things like that. And then they had the Toll Puddle Martyrs, and they had someone called Deirdre Barlow and her Free the Weatherfield One campaign. Now, my energy levels are much better, as you can see, but they're not back to normal because I've been introduced to this marvellous drink by this man. Um, because, you see, the human host is starting to walk and exercise a bit because he might be getting back to work. So he was walking around this place called the Pendu Recreation Ground, but he got very, very tired and he sat on a bench near this big NHS building. Uh, but he was... So tired he fell asleep so I ended up being awake and taking over and this very very nice man sat next to me and he said that I looked very worn down and that he I needed somebody to pick me up so he wanted to sell me some coke <gasps> but, but I know that the human host has tons of the stuff at home so uh, in tins and I politely said no thank you but I did realize that um, I was never awake when the human host drank it. So next time the human host went for a tin, I stayed awake and it's marvellous stuff! <laughs> it's fizzy and it, and it, and it makes you sparkle and, and you want more of this stuff, more. And I've been drinking tons and tons and tons. <laughs> oh, but in the UK also, um, the humans seem very conflicted because um, they're very happy because it looks like their lockdown is coming to an end and they're getting back to a normal life. But they're very apprehensive because they're not sure what that normal life may be because the government are talking about introducing a passport so that people who want to go into pubs and into restaurants have to show it. Um, so people aren't, some people aren't happy about that because what happens if you can't get a passport? And then also, um, a lot of their shops, famous shops, are being closed down like John Lewis and a place that used to sell travel called Thomas Cook, but they renamed it to something called Twee. <laughs> But I'm not surprised that uh, people don't want to go to this shop called Twee because it sounds like someone's spitting at you and your get, get, face get very, very wet. <laughs> now, in Scotland, uh, things are getting very re resolved slowly or things are getting better. Well, no, they're getting resolved. Yeah, things are getting resolved because... Um, because but it's not getting less confusing. <laughs> things are getting resolved, but it's not getting less confusing uh, because... Um, they had a, a lawyer, a lawyer that was appointed by Nicola, and he said that, that she hadn't built, broken the ministerial code uh, and that she didn't intentionally mislead Parliament, the Scottish Parliament. But then the inquiry said that she did mislead Parliament so that she has to resign and they took a vote on it. But Nicola won and she stays. <laughs> But then Alex wasn't very happy uh, because I suppose it wasn't the result he wanted. And then he was also told off by Nicholas Scottish Parliament for actually letting the inquiry have the full report and not taking out the bits that Nicola wanted taking out, uh, like the truth. Um, so um, he wasn't very happy. So he started his own party, political party, called the Alba Party. Uh, but then um, he says that it wasn't to uh, rival Nicholas party called the SNP but you wonder why would you have a party then uh, and then also there's a, a person called Craig 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 and um, he was convicted of contempt of court because he reported about the inquiry which makes no sense because a lot of other people reported on the inquiry and he's going to be convicted in May now who the hell is Craig <laughs> uh, uh, and also in the news there's another place of the world called um, Asia and Africa and the humans there had built a waterway called the Sewage Canal and, and it connects 
uh, some place called the Red Sea, which I presume is coloured red, and the Mediterranean Sea, which I presume is coloured Mediterranean. Anyway, um, uh, anyway, there was a big ship called the Ever Given, and going down there and it was blown by this big gust of wind and it got stuck in the bank and it blocked the whole canal and and then all these ships were uh, building up behind it so everybody's unhappy because nothing gets through there's a big blockage and then people are trying to dig it out and it seems like there was wind um, there was a blockage there was a build up and there was sewage it sounds like constipation Uh, and, and there's a very famous boy uh, called Brooklyn, and his mother's very famous, so she's called Posh. And uh, she belonged to a group called the Spice Girls. Um, and I believe they cooked curry or something, very famous for cooking curry. But he apparently dressed up like his mum and her friends and did this video, and the whole internet were very excited about it and loved it. Though I don't think the human host was that impressed because apparently he did that every weekend when his parents went out. Anyway, I'll get back to you next weekend. Um, I'm going to drink more of this stuff. Uh, 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 I'll report back. Mm. <laughs> twee! <laughs> twee! 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 Twee!